one of our GK Plus users is having some difficulty with this design, which is used as a, as a palette. Um, she puts all of her useful symbols together in this drawing and then uses it to draw from when creating new designs. If, however, we right click and pick Zoom Extents, we lose the entire drawing. There's probably some entity well off and displaced well away from the main set of symbols. If we right click and pick Zoom Previous, we can get back to where we were. What I want to try and do now is see if we can determine where that missing entity or block has been placed way off to the extremities of the drawing. I have tried zooming out and picking a window down bottom left and moving across like so and then coming in here, zooming even further out and searching for whatever it is that's off screen and destroying our Zoom Extents tool use. But I've not been able to find it. So let's try another way. Let's zoom a window now back there. You saw me hesitate. I didn't want to choose Zoom Extents because we would lose the whole lot. Let's look at the blocks in this drawing. And if I start at the top, what I'm looking for are some blocks that aren't referenced. And as I move down through, I haven't found any unreferenced blocks yet. But when I get to this one here, here we are. Took me a little while to find it. A Stilber Pink Lotion. That's a block with apparently nothing in it. And what I want to use now is a, a technique that we've shown you before, which can help locate where that missing block is. And that might be the one, we can't see it, that might be the one that's been displaced. So we can say edit. It's empty, we can't see anything in it. By zoom extents, that still doesn't help. We want to find it in the drawing. Where is it? But what I'm going to do now is put some text in it. I'll, I'll use the text, the word find, for lack of any other word, and I'll make it very big, like so, and I'll make it a bit of an angle, and then close the block editor and return to our drawing. Now we can see all over this drawing if we pick one of those instances of the word find, and you see what has happened. There's a, a block down here, hammer, hamelis, into media, and it must contain a whole lot of other blocks, the stilba blocks, which are actually empty. So we now know where it is. So what we're going to do is to edit this block and see if we can at least remove that one from it. The first step is to make a note of the name of that block, Hamamalis Intermedia. So now we explode it. Then we can just eliminate all these instances. Oh, you can see the base point is way down here for most of them. Just want to make sure that it's not tied to any other block. I don't think it is. So we can delete those. So we can just gradually work our way in this design and get rid of all instances of the word find. But we need to go back to the original block where we had a problem. Here it is. And you can see now that we've broken it up into its constituent parts. It had a nested block inside it, which is the one we've now hopefully removed, the one that we've tagged with the word find. And now we want to make that block again. So we'll select all of the elements in it and create a block. And we need to find 
that block. There it is, Amamelis Intermedia. And we importantly pick a, always pick a big point. So I do that. Now we've posed the question, do we want to redefine the block? Well, certainly we do. And now I hope, it may not happen, but I hope that when we go back into here, and we look up, it was in the still be here. Let's just run through those. That one's visible, that one's visible, and we're down through there. Here's our visible one, which is still in the drawing somewhere. Now I can just see the word fine there. Uh, so some other symbol, or we might have missed uh, eliminating every reference to it. What I want to do is to get to a point where I can actually delete that block because we don't need it anymore. So I'll close from there and use another, what I hope is an interesting technique, and click in Modify and find some text. We want to find the text F-I-N-D. And what we're hoping to do is to use that technique to locate it. And I can't, so what I'm actually going to do is to save this drawing and come back to it and see if we can get rid of that block, because sometimes you need to save it and come back in in order to remove blocks that you think you've eliminated. Here we are back into the drawing, and we can now purge or get rid of that block. And I'll say delete all unused ones, and away we go. So I've cleaned up the drawing, and at this stage, I'm ready to try another zoom extents to see if we've resolved our problem. And indeed we have if we now zoom in on part of the drawing there and then right click and zoom extents, the drawing behaves as it should. So the take home lesson is be careful when making blocks. Make sure that the base point is indicated in the center of the symbol. And if you are going to use nested blocks inside other blocks, make sure that those blocks have some content and don't show in the blocks list as an empty block.